I just want to have a look inside this uh, Type 2 connector which is attached by a cable to my EVSE electric vehicle supply equipment because in here linking PP and protective earth proximity pilot or plug present and protective earth should be a resistor and that resistor tells the car which is connected to this end don't pull more than X amount of current because the cable isn't up to it. Now some uh, EVSEs or charging stations have sockets on them and you have to use a cable with a plug on either end. One's a plug, one's a socket actually in reality. But you supply your own cable. Now the charging station might say, well I'm capable of supplying seven kilowatts. So it puts out a square wave on the control pilot saying, yeah, car, take seven kilowatts, it's available. The car will receive that signal and say, okay, well, I'm happy to take seven kilowatts and put it into the battery. But you've come along with a wimpy little cable with 13 amp three core mains flex <laughs> attached to uh, your plugs at each end. And of course that would burn out. So in here there was, there's a resistor and that also tells the car, don't pull more than a certain amount of current. Now, as far as I can tell, there are only three values of resistor, uh, 1500 ohms, 680 ohms, and something else. I'll just check that. Yeah, 1500 ohms in here would say, don't pull more than 13 amps because the wire can't, and the connectors uh, can't support it. Uh, 680 ohms, don't pull more than 20 amps. 220 ohms, don't pull, pull more than 32 amps. And 100 ohms, don't pull more than 70 amps single phase. Right, taking the screws out of this, um, it does appear to be welded along the seams though, although I'm not sure the weld's been very successful. Let's have a look at it. Yeah, that's the weld. I think they've just tipped a bit of plastic weld or some sort of solvent in there, but it doesn't look like it's very good down this end. I've just slightly prized it apart with the blade. So I think I'll continue that process and try and get this uh, thing off. Can't get it focused. There we are. So I'll try and get this open and see if we can see that resistor. So I'm just putting this uh, blade in there to try and split this apart. Now this is a 16 amp or up to 16 amp EVSE. So it should have the 20 amp rated resistor, which would be 680 ohms. And in fact, we can measure it. So let's go from PP to protective earth and there we are 680 ohms now on my other granny charger which was the one supplied with the car which is limited to 10 amps i've done the same measurement and it is just slightly short of 1500 ohms so here we are inside the plug now unfortunately um there is now a breach in the little rubber bead that sits in this groove there's a little gap up there now and I can lift this rubber out and stretch it but then it just <laughs> sort of shoots back so I need to find a little bit of rubber band or something to put in there and unfortunately that's right on the top and right at the bit where the where it's kind of uh, flat topped when plugged into the car water would roll off there but it may pull there anyway that aside because uh, this all had to be yanked quite hard to get it off we can see that um, the blue, brown and yellow orange, uh, sorry, yellow green come through into li uh, neutral protective earth in the middle and live at the bottom. Control pilot is the black wire that runs into the CP connector, which is there. Um, PP, the proximity pilot, doesn't come out of this cable. I can't see the cutoff grey wire. Uh, there's some bits of this sort of I don't know, some sort of internal wrapping in there. Maybe it's uh, buried in there. But uh, what uh, you can see is that there's grey wire coming out of the PP connector, which is there. It sort of loops around, goes to a bulge in a bit of heat shrink, and then goes in with... I don't know whether you can see this very easily, but there's, you can just about see a wire coming round there and going in with protective earth. So that's the resistor linking PP through a 680 ohm resistor. We measured that to protective earth. 
and that tells the car don't pull more than a certain current despite what you're being told with the pulse width of the CP signal don't pull more than a certain current because the cable assembly which may have a plug at both ends may have been supplied uh, at an un with an underspect cable the cable assembly can only handle a certain current so that's what that resistor does